I've been trying to figure out the whole YouTube business model and, and the analytics. And so before I start these things, I'm always going into people's content and trying to figure out what's getting views and what isn't. And um, have you have you tried to demystify what's going on on the back end there? Um, I mean, only on kind of a <laughs> surface level. Um, definitely my paranormal ones were getting more views and that's something that kept me doing it for a long time. Um, I don't know if that was just because it was kind of a niche and I could create a ton of very specific playlists around that. Um, I think it just helped because like you would find my channel through one of those videos and then find the rest of them. Whereas the other more general ones are kind of everywhere so they're definitely not working as well for me but i'm trying to do this for fun and not for like success so mm. i try not to focus too much on like you know where is this video in my last 10 you know that awful ranking thing they have on the front page yeah <laughs> It's always the videos, at least for me, it's all the videos that are doing best are the ones I, I want. I just really don't care about. They're the ones I don't really want to see doing well at all. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know if that's the same, but um, I like this quote from you. you. You write, or you said, and I could be paraphrasing, my handwriting is shit. I'm a regular human woman, and this is what we look like. You'll get used to it. <laughs> I think that that's a quote that's worth uh, putting up on your profile. Um, I hope you find a way to to continue doing paranormal in some form, even if it's under a, a pseudonym. <laughs> You're good at it. It's fun. Oh, thank you. Um, yeah, I think I definitely would. I would just take a different approach and maybe emphasize it being for entertainment and stuff in the videos instead of being so like, oh my God, this is real crazy, you know? I think I just need to take a different perspective on it. Yeah. Um, why do you think your, um, your, your video, how the contraceptive, was it pill, uh, fucked you up? Oh, the pill, yeah. You <laughs> over 3,000 views on it. Why do you think that is? Uh, because the contraceptive patches video has a lot of views and I think that's just again because it was a niche it wasn't a lot of people don't know contraceptive patches exist so um, that was just like good algorithm wise and then people will find the other videos I do about contraception and stuff from that gotcha has it inspired you to want to do more about that um when I have something to say about it, yes, um, but this is not kind of something that I have strong interest in. So I would definitely talk about my personal experiences, but I wouldn't kind of do the research and present things that I haven't had an experience with.